shapes hello children today we will learn how to identify the shapes of objects around us in the fourth grade you all have learned about making patterns with different shapes can you tell me which shape has been used to create this pattern if you wish you can pause the video here and think yes you identified it right children this pattern is made of squares so children can you identify shapes of objects around you just like this come let's go to my class today i'm going to discuss with the students some interesting facts related to shapes students so can you identify the shape of this blackboard if you observe this blackboard carefully and trace the four sides of the blackboard with the help of a chalk on the wall which shape will you get you can see that the length of the trace figure is same and the width is also same so this is a rectangle a rectangle is a shape which has four sides and the length of its opposite sides are the same now tell me which shape shall we get by tracing this map this is a square very good ravi a square is a shape that has four sides and all four sides are of same length now tell me that if we trace this bangle on a paper then which shape shall we get this is a circle absolutely right because this is a round shape in which the distance from the center point to its circumference is the same so it's a circle now tell me what is the shape of the upper surface of this pencil if we paint this upper surface and trace it on a paper then which shape shall we get teacher we will get the shape of a hexagon absolutely right hexagon has six sides that are joined this way students all of you must have seen such a flag yes teacher i have seen such a flag in a fair the shape of the cloth of this flag is like a triangle you identified it right priya triangle is a shape that has three sides that are joined like this summary so children today we have learned that if we observe an object carefully then we can easily identify its shape now all of you find shapes hidden in the objects at your home thank you shapes hello children do you remember that in the previous video i taught you to recognize the shapes of the objects today i will teach you to draw pictures of objects with the help of different shapes come let's see what ravi and priya are making in their books teacher if we want to draw a tree then which are the shapes should be used a tree can be made by joining the circle and rectangle first we will make the trunk of the tree with a rectangle then we will make eight small circles like this now if we join the outer boundary of this shape and erase all the other lines then it will become the upper part of the tree so isn't it correct come on now draw a kite i love flying a kite if we join four triangles together then a kite will be formed absolutely right ravi teacher now let us draw a hut hey that is very easy the front part of the hut's roof can be made with a triangle and the side wall of its roof with a square and then we will use square to make the walls of the hut something like this see here is the picture yes one more thing we can also make the walls of the hut with a rectangle something like this children do you know how does a star look like would you like to draw a picture of a star yes teacher every night i watch the stars in the sky but what is their shape teacher see priya to make a star first of all you need to make a pentagon now make a triangle on each of its edges 
you have to make five triangles like this. And see, we have formed a star. Come on, now look at this painting. Whose picture is this? This is a boat, teacher. I know how to draw it. If we look at the lower part of the boat, from the middle it looks like a rectangle. If we make one triangle each at both the edges of the rectangle, then the lower part of the boat would be complete. Now we will draw a line to make its upper part and will make a big triangle on its left side and a small triangle on its right side. How do you find my boat? Oh wow, the boat is made by just using the shape of rectangle and triangle. Summary So children, did you all see? How easily Ravi and Priya drew objects with the help of shapes. I hope you have also learned to draw these objects. In the next video, we will learn to draw some interesting objects by joining three or more shapes. Thank you. Today we will learn to draw some interesting objects by joining three or more shapes. So come on, let's go to the class. Children tell me which is your favorite cartoon character. My favorite cartoon character is Mickey Mouse. So come on, now tell me with which shape you can draw the character Mickey Mouse. It can be drawn by joining six circles. Its big face can be made with one circle, two circles for its ears, two circles for its eyes and one circle for its nose. Absolutely correct. Now tell me, can any one of you draw the picture of a cat? Yes teacher, I will try to do that. First of all, its eyes and face are made from three circles. Then its tail and four legs can be made with six rectangles. Now its ears, nose and upper part of its tail can be made with four triangles. At the end, its claws from four squares. See the cat is drawn. Teacher, is it correct? Very good Priya. This is a very interesting drawing. All of you must have seen the train. So come on, today let's draw its engine with the help of rectangle, circle, triangle and square. If you want, then you can pause the video over here and think. See this. Its wheels are like a circle and its chimney is made of two rectangles. Rectangle to draw the whole engine and one window in the shape of a square. So how was it children? Can you tell me the total number of rectangles, squares, triangles and circles in this picture? You can seek help from your friends and teachers. So children, did you see that how we drew different objects by joining three or more shapes? Now you also draw various beautiful pictures with the help of these shapes. Thank you.